a white ball with 26 on the shot clock. Here's Powell, ready to go, being guarded by the rookie Joe Fletcher. About a 17-year age difference in that matchup. And Denver showed some vulnerability yeah. last week against Rochester. I watched that game. Rochester, Mark Cochran, the, the rookie, six goals. Jordan Wolf was incredible, dodging. Beat Lee Zink for three one-on-one -on -one goals. That's a team that right now might be the hottest in the league. Talk about getting a confusion from the college, collegiate ranks. Miles Thompson, Cochran, and Jordan Wolf. That's, That's so a holding the attack now that Miles Thompson missed. by Mattis. Now Powell. And the launch, playing from behind. Yeah, but it wasn't malicious. He didn't lay him out. Yeah, I agree with you. One of the few times. Yeah. Now Powell's going to run away. Wow, they call warding off on Casey Powell by way of Maryland. Powell. Kio. You know, Keo is a, a Canadian finisher that loves his right hand. I don't know there if I'm Stevie Keo, I switch lefty. I catch that righty and go behind the back. Here's Fletcher on Powell. Looking for Thule, who runs out of an angle. Gets it back to Powell. 30 on the shot clock. Now Thule wants it on the invert to take a look at the short stick. That's what Team USA is thinking. Next week at the World Championship. Thule draws the double, doesn't matter, and he draws the flag. And they take advantage. Does that get the launch going? You can definitely feel the wind picking up. You see some of the advertisements in the trees blowing all over the place. And wow, Casey Powell. Reminds everyone in the stadium that he is indeed Casey Powell. The wind can't slow the old man down in his game. Give me my rank up. I've watched a lot of Major League Lacrosse this year, and Casey Powell's game is just air tight. One of the best passers in the league. He's so creative. They don't like to get their hair cut, though. I mean, come on. Gibson, Fowler, Kavanaugh. Find a barber on the island. I don't get to start over Adam Fullerton, and that's why they call it execution. The feed to the crease. It's a lot easier to just kind of rip it high because your stick's low, it moves high. To get that thing to bounce, another story. Keo to Powell. So maybe the Lizards fell asleep, mentally put this one in the wind column a bit too early. It's a tough out in the postseason. Let's go back up! Fletcher loses his footing. Powell there to take advantage. Too easy. Too, too easy, as they like to say, up in the queues. You know, Joe Fletcher has been a bright spot for the Lizards, I think. He just hits the turf monster right there, and that's not typical defense. I think Joe Fletcher, as a rookie, and Durkin last year as a rookie, these two guys were as pro-ready as any two guys I, I can remember over the last decade. Playoff picture starting to come into focus here as teams go one way, the launch going to the other. And they say in practice, Brady's been an absolute stud. Can't stop that Keo opportunity. Keo can finish flat out. 